Guys, you're, like, you're here at the Emmys yeah, again, and, I, and you've won before. What was that moment like when you went up on that stage and accepted that trophy? I can only imagine. Because I was in, I was in Toronto uh, watching a football game, as a matter of fact. So you got the news by text? I did. My friends, my other fellow composer friends were also nominated. We're like, dude, you, you beat me. Where are you? Yeah. Well, now, if you both win tonight, that'll make up for that it, day. It will. So I've never had that feeling, and yeah, hope, hoping to tonight. So tell us about Alias Grace, about working with Netflix. It's, it's probably different than working with other networks or studios that you have before, right? Well, you know, for us, it comes down to the film and the filmmakers. Um, not so much the banner we're working under. So, you know, we were excited to get such a good project to work on. It's a really beautifully shot and made movie. And uh, we just got to work with Sarah Pauli and Mary Heron and uh, had a great time working on it. Yeah, yeah and it's fun for us. Um, it's a historical tale and it's got this, you know, whole ambiguity air about it. So it's, it's all mood. The whole piece is about mood and that's music. And so it was really fun to work on it and felt like we were really you know, contributing to the to the effect of the, of the storytelling. And how did you originally get involved in the project? I've known Sarah Pauly since she was like 13. Yeah. <laughs> um, we worked on Road to Avonlea together up in Canada and um, watched her grow up into a fine woman and you know now she's writing and producing and uh, now she's your boss and now she's my boss yeah that's right <laughs> so what do you think your chances are tonight we're, we're uh, an awards website we love oh, talking oh, about oh I'm familiar with uh, right. believe me I'm on your site every day who do you think's your biggest competition let's put it that way uh, I, I would say Godless by uh, merit of the fact that they have 12 nominations it's right. kind of a juggernaut yeah. and those things tend to get some momentum so I would yeah. say that would be the, the one to beat you're also up for Last Tycoon. Yes. Yeah. Uh, tell us about that. It was the, just the main title sequence, right? Main title, yeah. And it's uh, another period piece, 30s Hollywood, so really fun, glamour and glitz and a little bit of darkness and intrigue. Kind of like, you know, Hollywood today. Yeah. So, uh, it's cool. Yeah, it is. So it, that's also a really fun period to write music for. And, uh, real orchestra as well as you know, Ellie's Grace. Yeah. So yeah, really both really worthy things that I'm really proud of. TV music today is just so much better than it was like 10 years ago. Yeah. Yeah. It's really impressive. It well, thanks a lot, guys. Have fun. Good Thank luck. You. Yeah.